Because this story is about Comic Sans, the most disagreed upon and tweeted about assemblage of letters in the history of the world, a consideration which includes Times New Roman and Helvetica, not to mention the original dark Germanic type favoured by Johannes Gutenberg, the CERN story has its inevitable echoes. The year after the Higgs boson discovery, Dr Peter Higgs, then aged 84, of the University of Edinburgh, and Dr Francois Englert, then 80, of the Université Libre de Bruxelles, were awarded the Nobel Prize in Physics for their work enhancing our understanding of the origin of mass of subatomic particles. I am overwhelmed to receive this award and thank the Royal Swedish Academy, Higgs said in a statement. Englert said, You may imagine that this is not very unpleasant. This news and these quotes now appears on the Nobel Prize website in a typeface named Alfred Regular, or Alfred Sands, designed in 2018 to unify the Nobel brand. Previously, each department had its own look. It was made by Stockholm Design Lab, who were also responsible for logo and brand rethinks for Ericsson, Adidas and Ikea and was inspired by the unnamed font engraved on the Nobel Gold Medal from 1902. There were also serif versions for text and display, each with an italic. It is a gentle, accessible and versatile type with a geometric preference and a suggestion of Art Nouveau, and was intended to reflect a timeless and universal impression of free thinking and openness. Although Alfred Regular contains some proprietary twists, a very similar version named Evar is available commercially in many sizes and weights from the digital foundry Letters from Sweden. In early April 2014, two years after the Higgs boson announcement and one year after the award of the Nobel Prizes for the work, CERN unveiled a rebrand of its own, something to bring it further into the digital age. As was now commonplace, the new look would use its own typeface across all its sites, something easily translatable into all languages. The news was heralded by a brief YouTube video of Fabiola Gianotti, of course, announcing the switch. As of today, CERN web pages will be written in Comic Sans. She was also quoted in the accompanying press release. When preparing my Higgs presentation, at first I had Georgia on my mind, but when I saw the closely spaced, slightly squishy, rounded characters in my drop-down menu, I knew in my heart that Comic Sans was the right way to go.